child of God, pride came before a fall. Your pride came before a fall. And then, you know, God hates pride. He hates pride, prideful people and a haughty look. He hates a haughty look. There's literally a look people make when they're prideful, when they act like they're so powerful. Like if they did think taking credit for everything that that is going on good in their lives and stuff like that. And because you're giving yourself the glory instead of giving God the glory. And um, so he may have taught you a lesson and the Lord may have been angry with you to show you. To put you in your place, honestly, because the Lord, no, nothing is going to steal. He doesn't share his glory with us, okay? He doesn't share his glory. He's not going to give you his glory and let you take credit for the things that he does in your life to bless you. The things that he entrusts to you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. In Psalm chapter 30 David went through that he was asking God thanking God that he didn't let his enemies um conquer him and defeat him he didn't allow his enemies to defeat him so at the same time God will teach you a lesson while still loving on you and protecting you from your enemies because really God chastens those who he loves God teaches people a lesson because he like he loves them okay and he wants you to he wants to correct you and fools despise wisdom and f only fools despise correction fools hate correction so you don't want to be like that but this this message is for somebody that learned their lesson and now god wants you to sing like you've had a change of heart and god is proud of that he's proud of you okay he's happy for you god wants you said god says in um verse 4 from psalms chapter 30 sing to the lord all you godly ones praise his holy name for his anger lasts only a moment but his favor lasts a lifetime amen so you know don't get it twisted which you haven't you did good you get it just don't be prideful no more that that's considered the original sin okay that's what satan did and like that's what he he put he tries to fill us up with pride trying to make us feel like we're little gods like we're god you know and like no 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 <laughs> we're, we're not weeping may last through through the night but joy comes with the morning weeping may last through the night and that's because if there's no pain there's no gain right we're we're stubborn people okay and god knows that that it takes pain for us you know to get us to to change have a true change within but joy comes with the morning and you know the morning just represents the lord's faithfulness even the nighttime coming uh is a display of the lord's faithfulness and you know he talks about that in um isaiah chapter 55 or actually, no, he talks, not chapter, Isaiah 55, he talks about it in um, Jeremiah chapter 33. Okay, so, so yeah, that's all I wanted to say, you know, like, go praise God and be thankful, you know, for everything that you have and give God the glory. Amen. God bless you. I'll see you soon.